Hello everyone. Welcome to Aptitude Jab. This set from CAT 2018 slot 1 DILR says that there are 8 students, 4 female students and 4 male students. Their name starts from A, B, C, D. They study in 3 institutes X, Y and Z. Each student majors in one subject among marketing operations and finance and minors in a different one among these subjects. So for, for every student, we need to mark the institute, major and minor. Now major and minor are out of three, three subjects and they have to be different. Now we are given more information about these students. In such kind of questions, we need to draw the table and we need to think that how do we uh, try to make the first column? Should we put institute first and X, write the name of students, Y, the name of the students, or should we put major and minor subjects or the student name? Now we are given the student names A, B, C, D. It is easy to remember plus four male and four female. So we will put, let's say the names as A, B, C, D. And the we will not make eight rows. We will just make four rows, four for male students and four for female students. So this is, uh, let us say these are the female students, these are the male students with the names A, B, C, D and institute, major and minor, institute, major and minor. Now we will directly jump to point number 5 because these gives direct information about the names of students. So Adriana and Dev are from the same institute. So let us say these two people are from institute P. Similarly, Daisy and Amit are from same institute. So let's say these are from institute Q. Next is Barun is from Y and majors in operations. So he is from institute Y and majors in operations. Similarly, Chetan is from X and majors in finance. Daisy minors in operations. So Daisy minoring in operations. So we have filled these information. Now we will look at the other information it says three from x three from y remaining two students both female are from z now understand this we have already got people from y and x right one one person each now these cannot be the same institutes they have to be different two institutes and two female should be from z both female so if you put this as x uh, this as z this will also become z right Similarly, if you put this as Z, this institute will also become Z. So we cannot have male students from institute Z. So this clearly means that these two people are from Z. Now P and Q will be, these P and Q are either X or Y in any order that we will fill later. Both the male students from Y minor in finance and while the female student from Y majors in operations. Now, D is minoring in operations, cannot have major in operations. So, this means the female student from Y is majoring in operations and this is A. So, that means P institute is Y and Q institute is X. So, institutes are done, right? Now, we will fill this information. Both the male students from Y minor in finance. So, these two students minor in finance. Now we are left with just two more points. Only one male student majors in operations. So that means this person majors in operations. These two cannot major in operations. Now if this person uh, D does not major in operations, cannot um, major in finance also. So this person uh, D will major in marketing. Okay, so that is what is given to us. And while three female students minor in marketing. So one female student is already minoring in operations. So rest of them will be minoring in marketing. Last condition, one female and two male students major in finance. So one female, which female major in finance cannot be determined. So one finance is there and two male students major in finance. So one male student is already majoring in finance. Another male student will major in finance. So this is how the table uh, can be formed and then we can subsequently answer the questions. So we know that one of the female students will major in finance, which one we do not know. 
who are the institute uh, who are the students from institute z easy to say b and c which subject does dev minor in so dev is minoring in so we we'll talk about uh, dev the minor subject is finance if chitra majors in finance which subject does bandita major in so if chitra majors in finance we need to find bandita so bandita cannot major in finance because only one female student in finance she cannot major in marketing as well because she is minoring in marketing so she will major in operations which subject does amit major in so amit has a major subject as finance 